So from a snowy and wintry Scotland, we would like to send our warm best wishes to Kathalaya on its 20th anniversary. And of course, we've known uh, Kathalaya and Gita Ramunajam since the very beginning. Uh, we have warm memories of her coming here first as a storyteller uh, and us doing the old tradition of passing round the hat so as we could keep her on the move back down to uh, London. And it's fantastic in that 20 years to see what has been achieved. Of course, we ourselves have just celebrated the 30th anniversary of the Scottish International Storytelling Festival, at which we were delighted again to have uh, Gita as a guest. And I suppose that when one looks back over those periods of time, 20, 30 years, one of the things that you keep coming to is the refreshing of storytelling, the newness of it, Every time you set out on a new story, a new audience, it's a fresh adventure. Everything has to be made and created anew for that moment, for that purpose, for that connection, for that gathering of humanity in that time. And that remains at the very centre of the art of storytelling, the worldwide art of humanity in which we are all engaged in Scotland and in India. And uh, I think that some of our recent festivals, particularly our global gathering uh, in 2017, uh, has underpinned how much now this is a worldwide renaissance, a worldwide uh, movement, uh, connecting different traditions and cultures and different challenges that we have in education and development and the environment in peacemaking as a worldwide uh, human community. So we very much look forward to the future of uh, our relationship between Scotland and Kathalaya. Uh, we're delighted to see the way that your training courses have come on and developed and uh, we uh, very much support those. It'd be lovely to see that uh, strengthening of the role of storytelling in education in English also celebrated, of course, and reflected in the mother tongues of India, the many mother tongues and the many universes of narrative and story that are part of India's resource. And we in Scotland feel a very old connection with that and we look forward to further creative exchanges, further shared work on global partnership and education. But for now, it's, there's always a moment just to uh, celebrate, uh, to rest content for a short while and to be thankful of all that has been achieved and to gather our hopes and our aspirations for what is still to come. So a very, very happy anniversary to you all and best wishes for the future.